Yeah, okay, so we have a first game going. Stevie's spy, hello, and good luck. So some Scandinavian happening. And uh, yeah, I'm playing Knight F3 because uh, this is some sort of trick that allows me to get d4 and c4 and not play knight c3. Anyway, bishop g4 is a good move, so I'll just go bishop e2. And yeah. Then, okay, e6, also very good, so I'll just go for my c4 now, and probably h3 because I don't want to run knight c6 and have to go bishop e3. Now if uh, if he goes knight c6, I'll go d5 or g4. Mm, or both maybe. So and if knight c6 is not possible, then I I have the center. This is my point. So c6, yeah. It's all very solid. It's a very solid line. Anyway, um, so queen b3, of course, attacking the, the pawn on b7. So queen c7, yeah, now I have some some tricks, so it's time to go pass a rush. So I go bishop f4. Also, actually, what I did is just very dangerous, because if it takes, I take on b7, bishop b7, queen takes a8, queen c7 could have happened, and then my queen would have been trapped, so. And I'm sure this was my smartest. Anyway, it didn't take. Hmm. I'll just go d5 because I have development, so it's time to open the center. So, okay. So what should he do? Maybe let everything like as it is and just develop like knight d7 for instance is a move, knight a6, mm, bishop e7, no that would allow d6 but probably not take everything in the center because then the king would be exposed. Yeah so now I castle. Um, just to get my king out, and then I'll take on d5. It should be quite unpleasant. But, I mean, very solid play so far from, from Stevis. Like, he probably should take on f3. Yeah, I'm not sure about bishop g6, it's, it's a bit slow. Um, I have a decision to make. I think I'll go bishop d6 uh, if I can. Actually, I'm not, yeah, yeah, I can bishop d6. So I want to avoid uh, the possibility of castling. Hi, Biotolomeris. Good to see you. Good to see everyone. And happy to be here. So queen d7, yeah, that was, I was uh, calculating, so my idea now was bishop b5, knight c6, and now rook e1. I pin the bishop. Also, after long castle, it's not over yet, because after rook e7, queen takes d6. Uh, or even queen takes e7, it's, long castle actually would be a very good move. Yeah. So I might not be better at all here. Probably I have to go rookie seven anyway. 
But no, Queen, okay, Queen takes d6, Queen e7 was a touch better. And I'll go Bishop c6, Rook c6, Knight e5. Although this is still far from being over. And after Knight e5, Rook c7, I'm not sure I'm better. Um, yeah, then I'll just go Rook e1. Oh, the in the equipe. Yeah, it's about Roger. It was his title in uh, pretty sure Wimbledon, but uh, uh, it's won some title. Anyway, it's Roger. Who else could it be? Oh yeah, I don't want to lose today. I'm really motivated not to lose today. Um, okay, so h6. Yeah, I probably should go knight e5 anyway. So at the rook c7, I'm only minimally better, but... There's nothing else I can really do. Okay, rook c2 helps me, but still. Not that clear, because now rook takes a b2 happens. I'll go rook e7 anyway, get the rooks on the 7th rank. But very decent game so far. What's the best cafe in Paris to play chess? Um, uh, there's Cafe de l'Est, uh, which is near the, um, uh, the train station, Gare de l'Est. And there's a couple of houses, but I haven't been to that many yet. So, yeah, now I got two pawns up, so it's uh, probably over. Uh, yeah, I mean, I was probably technically going to win, but uh, yeah, you should have defended the, the pawns on b7 and a7 uh, around here. Like rook c1 was not ideal because anyway rook c7 was not really a threat. So now I'll go a5, I want a6 and rook b7 check. Oh, oh rook a8 is checkmate. Okay, so good game. And uh, let's see who else I can play. So let's play with Max Mlinek from Poland and good luck to you. So let's play the Karakan. Okay. So yeah, D4 is generally not ideal because it helps me a bit. Mm. I just need not to play d3 no next move because of queen a5 check. Uh, queen b6, I'll just go a4. And after a6, I might go back to c4 because the queen on b6 is misplaced a bit. I'm always out of book. Why do I even prepare for the games? H6, all right, I'll just castle. And now after knight f6, yeah, oh yeah, this is a um, common theme that what will happen uh, next move. After e5, I'll just go e6. And um, yeah, it's not ideal because the bishop on f8 is a bit, uh, it's kind of buried now. So, um, yeah, but 97, 95 was a good reaction to, uh, I mean, it's still better for me, but it was a good reaction. So now, I'm not sure if I should uncastle. castle. 
because I like my bishop, but anyway, I'll do it. And I'll play for the e5. <clears throat> Is the Luxembourg Garden a good place to play chess? Mm, it depends on the weather, but yeah, if the weather is good, you, you're gonna find a couple of people there, like uh, 10 or 20, at least 20 actually. Um, I'm not there quite often enough, but uh, I've been there a couple of times. So now, I think I will not take on a on e5 because um, then it's just easy for for Max Milinek to play. So I'll go f5 and at some point I will want to go f6. So this is a common theme in the King's Indian for instance. So just for for people to know. So I'll go knight e4. The, the idea of course that I didn't take the pawn on e5 is so that my knight is so powerful on e4. So I could have played queen g4 knight h5, that might have been good too. So king h7, mm, yeah I'll go queen h5, and next move might be f6. Actually I might have been better off playing f6 right away. But boss look good. So rook f8. Um, yeah, I have to go f6 now, and after bishop f6, bishop g5, I think this is, this is gonna be good for me. So I threaten rook f6, the bishop g5, knight g5, check, king g8, rook f8, check, king f8, queen f7 is mate. Hello, of course, knight 57. And thanks again to everyone for for tuning in and uh, watching this sub Saturday. All right, so this happens. Yeah, Bishop G five. Yeah, this was fun. This was a fun end. So let's play our next game. So up. In the Dolo Dilloween is next. Good British opponent. So e4. Um, what do you guys want me to play? Let's play Scandinavian. So d4. Yeah, this is actually why in the first game I played knight f3 and not d4 because of e5. So now the point is after d takes e5, I think I can take on e5, I might also take on d1. So knight f3 happened, and now I'll just take on g4, queen g4, knight f6. This is very, very equal, but uh, knight c3, so I'll take on d4, I'll play bishop d4. And just castle. And of course, this is yeah. This is well. This is not drawish. This is equal. So, um, yeah. Here I already get some sort of initiative. I think by attacking the pawn on c two. Um, I have a feeling, bishop d two, bishop e two, knight f three. I'm not sure which of the move is guilty but just all a bit passive to me so a3 and now i'll go bishop c5 so i'm aiming at f2 this time i mean still a long way to go it's it's really just equal material I'm just hoping that my bishops will be a bit more active at the end of the day. 
So I decided to avoid knight b5. But um, yeah, and now I threaten knight e4. So I think he should come back to c3 with his knight. Bishop g5, yeah, I thought about that, but now I take. Rook takes. Now I can either take on f2 right away. I can start with rook e8, attack the bishop on e2, or play knight e4, attack the bishop on g5. I think I'll go rook e8, but bishop f2 might be the most direct. Um. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna end up being a pawn up. This is certain. So bishop f6, yeah, now this is not a good move. Probably bishop d3 was better. Because now I take on e2, I attack the bishop on e f6. And also I threaten rook takes c2, which is uh, lethal. So bishop d4, yeah, I'll just take on c2. King d1 has to be played. Then I'll take twice on d4. And um, then if rook takes d4, rook d2 check. And I get the, the rook. All right. So new game. And let's play Thomas Dobson. Good luck to you. I'm assuming Thomas. Thanks, Opin. Yeah, this was a fun game. All right, so Sicilian, of course, I have to, to be faithful to the knight of this time. Well, no knight of, okay. Wise move here. Uh, let's go knight f6. Yeah, I, I'm a bully. Yeah, that's that's exactly who I am. So d3, I'll go e6. Bishop e7, I'll just castle. Probably at some point I should go d5, but uh, yeah, not yet. And also no d5, after d5 you can go bishop d3, so... Um, yeah, this is very legit opening for, for white. Bishop f4, I'm not a fan, I would rather go c3, bishop d3, bishop c2, knight d2. Um, now I think I can play g5. And it kind of forces e takes d5, which is good news for me. So after bishop d3, d takes e4, d takes e4, queen takes d1, I win a pawn. So this is exactly what's gonna happen. So, yeah, if you guys have any question, I'm happy to, to answer them. Oh, c4. Yeah, as a rule of thumb, uh, this kind of move shouldn't be played. Uh, the pawn would stand perfectly well on c3 because it would control d4. It would also block my bishop if I decide to go bishop f6. So yeah, c4. I would have gone c3. Um, so bishop c2, yeah, I'll just go drop back my knight. Are there any good open tournaments in France? Um, I mean, there are. I've just not been in enough uh, in the past few years, so... Mm. Um, well, the events in Corsica, for instance, are really good. Like, um, there's Sporticcio Open in June. And I've been there uh, just for vacation. I haven't played there, but it was really nice. Um, so this I can recommend wholeheartedly. Um, what else? Mm, a lot of 
uh, these events are fun but um, yeah really it's it's like the only one i've been to in recent years uh bishop c7 okay this is not great uh i think knight takes d4 was called for no i just go bishop f3 bishop d8 rook d8 take take on f3 and use the fork uh what do i think about the new Grandchester format uh the format has not really uh, changed in itself uh but uh yeah there's a uh, lot more of new events and that's quite good i think uh context i'll just go with d7 double attack Right, so knight takes f3, knight takes d2. So, and the bad news it's it's not only an exchange, but I'll have a6 at the end of the line, I'll attack the knight on b5, uh, and then, well, the bishop on c7 falls if the knight moves. Uh, knight a7, so another knight is trapped as well. Probably bishop takes b6 or knight c3 were both better option. What do I consider to be the most crucial line against knight of? Well, I'm not telling you, I'm not telling any, every, anyone. But of course, I mean, the poison pawn is um, always always a challenge but there's a lot of lines in the night of that are challenge all right rook c2 let's be cheeky i think i'll take with the pawn i know i give up the rook but then the pawn promotes um is there a delay no there's no delay like uh, I mean, there's a standard 20 second delay, but that's uh, that's pretty normal. Which six move do I prefer as white? You mean in the night of? Um, I've played my first shot of h3. Okay, so resign and let's find a new opponent. So let's play uh, um, Danny Challenge. So I need, well, uh, I actually need to. Well, to challenge someone. And five minutes. Well, hang on. Um, I'm trying to find my next opponent. I'm not finding one. Sorry for that, guys. Um, 
I'm just I'm just not sure who's uh, okay, so we have one. Attila Turso, here I come. Good luck. So, international master. Let's go. So this will be some sort of Grenfell. I'm not sure which one. Could be also a London system, obviously. Oh, the Troy attack. So bishop g5, this is... Um, well, this is gonna be theory. Uh, I'm expecting knight d2 now to prepare for e4 at some point. What do I think about my loss to Eric Hansen in bullets? Uh, I'm waiting for... to win the rematch. So e4, yeah, um, generally my point is I go d5, and after e5, knight e4, black is fine. But I remember a long time ago I prepared this line for white. I was gonna go e takes d5, knight d5, and something like knight c4, but this was uh, actually pretty bad. So bishop d3, okay, this is interesting. Because knight takes g5, knight takes g5. For instance, if I go f6, then I run into knight takes h7, king h7, king h7, king h5. Um, so probably I just end up playing bishop f5, I think that's safer. So castle, mm, I think I'll go c5, I can go knight c6, I can do one among many things. But knight c6, bishop e3, that would uh, not take me where I want. Um, yeah, then I'll just go c5, this is easier. Do I like the fact that there are more events in the Grand Chester this year? Yeah, indeed. I mean, it's it's more fun. Okay, bishop e3. Should I take on d4? Then maybe knight takes d4 is not altogether all that clear. Um, it's still a pawn. Um, I'll just go knight c6, I guess, because d takes e5, after that I have options, I'll probably go knight d2, queen d2, bishop g4, and pressure on e5. Also c3 is not an option because of knight takes c3, this is a cute motif. Do I play video games? Uh, not very often these days, but uh, yeah, it happens from time to time. Uh, also, I was always very bad at video games, sadly, sadly enough. So, g takes e5, yeah, I wanted knight d2, queen d2, bishop g4. I think, I think that's good for me. Right, bishop g4, so I'm attacking this pawn on e5. I mean, I threaten bishop takes f3 more, more importantly. Bishop e2, yeah, now I'll take bishop f3, play e6, and uh, I'll collect e5. It's not that it's so great for me, but um, I should be slightly better. At what age did I start playing? Um, uh, 
five or six years old. I mean, I learned the rules at five, at least six. I went to a club. Uh, Minesweeper. Yeah, I've actually played that, but uh, this is uh, kind of in the past now. Uh, C3, so now I'll go. Mm, yeah, I can go Queen H4. Also, if G3, I'll go Knight takes D4 because he cannot take on H4. The Knight takes F3, gets a fork. So I think he should take on E5. But then knight takes e5, and obviously I'm gonna be better here. So bishop e2, now I'll go rook fc8, b4 e5. Okay, queen d4 is a good move, I'll just go queen f6, knight d7 is next. Mm. So I'm not very afraid of any C force because uh, I'll just be better anyway. Do I go knight d7 or do I go a5 or b6? Maybe b6 is good. Yeah, b6 is probably the best option. Are there any off bits opening I played when I was younger but no longer? Um, mostly with white, yeah. Like I was playing King's Engine Attack. I was playing all sort of uh, stuff that ends up not working so well, and uh, yeah, so I changed. Um, so my top three all-time greatest chess players, and um, I. It's obviously subjective, but something along the line of uh, Fischer, Kasper, Falichin. Well, I did let A5 happen. Mm. Now the pawn is running. Uh, it's, I'm not sure it's still a big deal, but uh, I don't really know why I played uh, rook c8 anyway. So I got d4, a6, d3, try to um, get his bishop a bit passive. Also after bishop d1, so rook on a1 is unprotected. Whoa, bishop d3, okay. Uh, I'm not sure what this is. I guess I'll just take and come back with my rook to d8. I don't see, yeah, queen b7, rook a8. Of course, this is always a bit scary, but I'm supposed to be protecting more or less everything, so I'll go knight c4 now. If b6, queen d4. Oh no, not queen d4. Because then queen a8 and b7 is annoying. And actually, the same goes if I go e5. Um, should I play knight d6? Or queen b2, maybe? Queen b2 would be one. This, this is not really changing the situation. Well, I also know I'm up on time, so uh, I know I will be able to flag, but. I don't want to do so. Okay, I'll go knight d6. Queen c6, and no, queen e7. And after rook d1, yeah, I'll go king g7. I have some sort of trick. Rook takes d6, queen takes d6, queen d6, rook d6, b7, rook a7, so. And b8, queen, rook takes a1, was mate. Okay, this was a fun game. Okay, okay. Let's get a new challenge. Okay. Um, Super Genial is next. I mean, I have to play my fellow countrymen. So, uh, let's hope this is gonna be a French. 
now Alefin. Well, Alefin got French nationality, so uh, I'll be forgiving. It takes to five, and let's go bishop c4. Why am I so strong in blitz? Um, because I enjoy it mostly. Uh, I enjoy it and uh, it's pretty fun to play. Anyway, um, So, how do I proceed? I mean, this is still the start of the game. I'm not really better. I'm obviously not worse. So all it's good in the world. In the world of Hanish Kiwi. Not better, no worse. How much time do I spend on, on chess per day? It's really random. I don't have like uh, a fixed plan. But um, two, three hours per day. So, yeah, it's. I mean, just the position is uh, as a bit. I have a bit more space, but I'm not really better at all. Uh, I'll just take on d5 actually, but after ed, it would be, or cd, actually cd is also very good. And yeah, I'll try to set up something, but position is just very solid for now. Yeah, so give it jokes. He does he does this himself so I know I know I'm not offending him. So A6 yeah, of course I'm not gonna allow B5 and um, oh hey you cover good to see you and beware you're next I know you're next uh, knight b6, okay, this, this is helpful, I just go knight e5, and I want a5 next. Uh, Ikawa is not a sub, he cannot play, yeah, but I can still talk to him, right? Bishop d6. Yeah, let's go a5. So knight c4. Let's just take. Take everything and that'll go hook a4 at the end of the day. I'm playing too solid for my tastes. But. Um, yeah. I should really be more aggressive. So now I'm attacking c4, I'll attack b7, I'm slightly better, blah blah, but yeah, this is not what I want in chess. Here's as a nice trick for, for him, bishop e4 is a good move. Then if I play with takes c4, with takes bishop takes, bishop g2. Wins the pawn back. Oh, okay, he played it. Nice. Um, well, not nice, but nice. Uh, I think. Should I allow this anyway? Hmm. 
and it's very risky. No, also it doesn't work what I want. So um, I think I'll just go queen e3 and bishop f3. Yeah. Yeah, and now, well, obviously I don't have the same amount of pressure on c4 that I would have wanted, but I'm still better. Queen d5. I'm not sure whether I should take or not. I can also play rook e5, obviously. I think I'll go rook e5. Take on f3 and play rook b4. So, yeah, rook b4 is next, and then at some point I'll want rook c5. I think I can do it now, so I'll do it now. And yeah, I'm attacking b7, c4, it's probably too much. So, which one should I take? Put b7, rook c8, this might not be so clear. So I'll take on c4 instead. And rook c8, b4, and then rook d4 next. And this is a good solid pawns up. And I think super genial is gonna soon run out of time. But it was a fun game. Uh, okay, c6, or b5, and one of my pawns is going to promote. All right. Um, and all right, let's play against Omega TV. Uh, I'm not sure if I played him already. Okay, so let's play Stevie. And okay, yeah, my bad. I need to learn a few things about chess. All right, Stevie. I hope you're still connected. How do I handle suffering after a defeat? Uh, either I'm with my friends or, or I kill myself. So hopefully I have friends every time I lose a game. Also st stopping losing is uh, it's a good tip, but I did lose the last game of classical chess I played, so... 
So it's not always a guaranteed. Oh, yeah, game got aborted. Yeah. Sad. Okay. Let's go for Islam Go. And good luck. I mean, if Omega's TV, of course, comes back, uh, I'll be happy to play him again. Yeah, yeah, Omega's TV, you should win challenge. And... Yeah, what? Oh! Okay, I really thought this was going to be another bot. Uh, all right. So yeah. Okay. 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 Bishop is six. Yeah. Generally, the bishop is not going there. Also, I could have played knight b5 on the last move, I just didn't realize that. Uh, so at least bishop e6 was pairing knight b5. Uh, bishop g4. It's always a good thing to correct your mistakes. So. Bishop g4 is a good move. Knight can play e6. Yeah. And I'll just castle. Okay, so um, how do I proceed? Probably um, just bishop g3 is for the best. Um, castle. Yeah, I really don't have much here. Um, should I take on c6? I don't really want to. I'll go bishop h4. And then I want h3, g4, get rid of this pin. Okay, now I take on c6, definitely. And I'll go h3. And then... Ninety five. Yes, TBI. I saw you will challenge you. You're next. Okay, Bishop E5. Yeah, this was a blunder. Now the pin is. Uh, I mean, I'm with, I'm winning this knight. So C5. All right. I'm going for. I mean, I can wait to grab the knight. Uh, so I'll go queen f3 actually to add another attack. And I'll take it. Okay, this well, it's a piece up, yeah. So, uh, rook takes b2. Okay, no, I'm not sure I want to do that, but uh, I mean, I, I'm winning some more material, so I should do it. Take on g7, he takes on h4 because his queen is attacked, and then I take the rook. Oh, okay, no. Mm. Yeah, queen h4 was was a must. So now I'll just go g5. I threaten queen f6. Check. So you should go bishop f5. But queen f6. Yeah, now this is fatal. 
No, I wouldn't say root. And then I'll check and probably one would be eight. And this is along the lines of forced mate. Okay, okay, good game. Uh, so next up, uh, well, okay, I don't see Omega's TV anymore. Uh, so let's play against J Paul. And good luck. Okay, okay. So, okay, this is some sort of uh, cross Sicilian crime free attack. Uh, the first time I played against the crime free attack, uh, really allowed everything and I got lost so quickly. But I'm not an 8 year old anymore. Uh, okay, I have five. So I'm saying I'm not an eight year old anymore, but this is still scary. Um, if I take queen h4, wait. I think, I guess I should take with the g pawn then. So, yeah, queen h4, now I have to go knight g6, queen g8 with d8, and if queen h5, uh, I think I should be just fine. So, ef, ef, and well, at least I'm not losing life. Like I would in the past. So knight g5, uh, let's just go knight ge5. So yeah, um, okay, now there's no real attack, of course, on my king. Um, I guess I can just take on c4, take, play h6, and then I'll be able to take on g4. So this is good for me. Uh, so yeah, this is good for me. And I'll just go knight e5, attack the pawn on c4. And yeah, these three knight types we check wouldn't be good, so I am winning that one on c4. And pawns, always juicy. Okay, knight h5, so now I play knight f3 check. Get some eat out of knight king. 
and uh, let's just go bishop f5. Uh, okay, h3. I miss that. This is a good move. Uh, I'll take on c3. And I'm not sure for what. Because after bc, I'm not sure what I uh, should do. Okay. Uh, probably I should just take on c2. Um, yeah, yeah. H takes G4. Okay, that's a relief. Now I can take on G4 and I will take the knight on H5. So, uh, yeah, this was not a good idea. Okay, okay, uh, let's play Horse Knight. Let's go. Okay, so let's go B6. I've done that in the past. It hasn't gone always well, but... <clears throat> Yeah, G takes F5, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, that's what I remembered along the lines. There's also D5 I was thinking about. Will I give a draw tonight? Uh, I won't give it, you'll, you'll have to, to play for it, to play well. Uh, yeah, I'm actually on my, uh, with my headphones, so I don't hear the noise, but it might be la my laptop, yeah, that's right. Mm. Was my game against Ding Liren the favorite game of last year? Honestly, last year it didn't go well for me. I mean, at least I was traveling a lot, so and so yeah it was a good game but uh, yeah well i don't have any really good memories of 2018 i was just traveling for the most part at least chess wise any thoughts on Kremnik retiring i mean it's always of course a bit weird when a player that's been around for so long just uh, retires, but uh, uh, especially when it's a legend like Vladi, but uh, hopefully uh, he gets uh, what he wants out of it and his next, uh, his next uh, career projects are as interesting as uh, he hopes. So yeah, I mean, I have I was lucky, I mean, I've played him countless times, of course, I've also I worked with him a couple of times, so yeah, um, that was uh, really, really quite fun. People will confuse me with Maxim Lagarde, they do that already, or even worse, they can't as I confuse him with me. Okay, so Queen E2. Yeah, I kind of want to punish this move, but I can't yet. So I'll just cheekily play Rook E7, threaten Queen takes F4. Up, oh, he doesn't see it. He did. Um, so next, I'll just um, I don't know. Maybe play h4. H4 is always a good move. Oh, rook d1. No, no queen f4 works. 
screen is unprotected again. Why French guys prefer Gibraltar and not Tata still? Um, well, the atmosphere in Gibraltar is great. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, good game. Uh, let's play with Mirai Nikki. Good luck to you. And uh, yeah, I need. Um, okay, okay. Uh, so let's play some Italian. And go. Bishop e6. Okay. I was not expecting that. Um, yeah, let's just take and play c3. This is and d4. King d8. I have to assume that was a misclick. Yeah, King D eight. Um what do I think about the new tournament system with Armageddon chess? Um I'm not sure what to expect. So I like the ideas of experiments. So yeah, it's gonna be fun. Um, but, um, yeah, at least it's an experiment. We'll see how it works out. If it doesn't, well, I don't think there's any big arm done. And if it does, then it's even better. King G8 computer move. I really, really doubt that. Uh, if King G8 is a computer move, then I'm retiring from chess. This is a promise. Can we talk in French? Well, not today. Today I'm English. So yeah, knight b5, of course, there's some sort of pin, so it takes b5 is not great. Um, king c7. I don't have a punishment yet for that move. Even if I would like to. Mm, so yeah, I'll just take on d6, play knight g5. Yeah, I'm retiring from, from chess, but not today. Not here, not now. And let's play queen a3. Also, queen c2 might have been better, but after queen c4, I wasn't sure what to do. So, no queen a3, queen a7, knight f7. Probably. It's, well, b4. Yeah, now I'm going back to a4, and I'm winning the knight on c6. This is. This is really not good. So yeah, I think uh, now we need the knight sort of over. I think queen c6. Yeah, it's actually mate in two. King e7, queen d6, king d8, queen c7. So yeah, okay, good game. And let's play TV. I hope it doesn't disconnect again. And no, it's on. Let's go. So yeah, I went h4, but uh, uh, yeah, it's not really a big deal. 
even if he has a lot. That was um, H5. Alright, alright, let's go. So knight f3. Yeah, this is really again. My guys are not making blunders in the opening, so this is making me so sad. I need to work for my wins. That shouldn't be the case. Do I work with Fabli B? I've I've never worked one on one with him. I mean, a little bit when he was a French captain, but uh, he is a good friend of mine anyway. Danny Wench, good to see you. Uh, you probably have told me that today, like, or at least you you think it's so so badly that uh, I, I hear it. Not in my dreams, in my nightmares. Yeah, Danny boy is here. This is gonna be fun. Are we on for giant chess, Danny? Am I actually from Lyon? No, I'm not. Uh, I'm uh, born in the suburbs of Paris. So now I have a trick, which is uh, bishop f7, rook f7, knight e6. So this is a bit tricky, but uh, it sometimes works. Okay, okay. D5, can't I just take? I think I can. Suburbs of Paris, the place where football gods are created. Not sure. Uh, not sure who you're talking about. Where do I live in Paris? Well, I'm not gonna give out my address, not yet. But quite uh, close to the Luxembourg Gardens is this much I can tell. Do I watch soccer? Yeah. Do I watch football? Well, I only the Super Bowl these days because I don't really know anything about it. Mbappe is nowhere near football god. I'm sorry. Sorry to tell you, to burst your bubble. Tottenham Hotspur bet, yeah, best in England. Well, not best, but uh, I'm enjoying uh, rooting for them. So, uh, yeah, Knight F6, no, that shouldn't have happened. No, this is a fork. Are there riots outside my window? Well, they were pretty close to my place today, but uh, first of all, the, those were not riots. This is over. What do I think about Duda? He's really a good talent, that's for sure. Mbappe is still a prodigy. Yeah, I mean, I've never said he was not a prodigy, I've just said he has a lot to to work on if he wants to you know we always have some sort of uh, the French requires more than they they get we always love to complain city are overweighted 
well, at least Lyon kind of uh, crushed them. So yeah, maybe, but still, still a pretty good team. Uh, okay, let's get this thing down to an end game. I do have enough material to to win this comfortably. I'll just push my pawns now. Twitch detectives will find me now. Am I looking forward to Paris versus United? Yeah, I'm really looking forward to Wood against Paris in two days. Uh, no, actually three. I do have some sort of bet that says that uh, Manu will qualify, so... And even without that, I would be rooting against Paris, anyway. The French are really tough against the teams we don't support, so... Yeah, let's just promote the pawns. And... That all will be good. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, let's promote the pawns. Let's just promote. Okay, okay. And let's play Benny. Benny is there. Okay. Okay, okay. So this is some sort of fun. Ah, thanks TV, yeah. I am a killer, yeah. That's exactly who I am. Uh, I haven't been arrested yet, though. Okay, so this is pretty normal stuff for now. So I missed a lot of questions on the chat. Almost like I'm British. No, I'm. I really am not. Uh, well, great job choosing Sky. I'm not sure they chose him, but uh, like, I mean, of course they chose him, but it was supposed to be sort of temporary. And uh, yeah, in general, I mean, uh, the players were just so relieved to to get rid of uh, Jose, so that they start performing much better. Uh, so yeah, we'll see how it goes uh, in his second year of reign. Well, I miss bishop h3, uh, but bishop g2 actually wins. So now king g2, queen h3, or bishop g2, queen h2 is made soon. So yeah, just a little trick. Why do I support Lyon if I'm from Paris? Uh, not everything is related to your birthplace, I think. Chess by had to make some food. Yeah. Oh, does she not survive without food? This is a shame. Okay, so now I bring the other route to the party. Do I want a quesadilla? No, I really don't. But thanks for the... Thanks for the thought. Okay, let's get 
this night and yeah bring the pieces to erase the poor white king bishop g4 sort of next okay maybe bishop f5 actually is better this is just made in the next few moves like two moves okay three. okay good game uh let's play with tsunami from sweden all right um what do i play like, let's play classical and let's get this game started so this is a meran let's go for both phoenix or moscow who knows which one it will be mm, neither but it was a better option thoughts on gj i'm assuming that means gilet jaune um, yeah it would be too long to to answer and i don't think the, it's like uh, black or white in this area so um, yeah perhaps not the place nor, the, nor do i have the time to answer that correctly okay let's go let's play g4 h4 g5 and mate Oh yeah, no, I think people need a vengeance on the mods and I'm providing that for them. So yeah, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Ever lost to a girl? Yes. I mean, I'm assuming you're asking a classical game. So yes, it happened twice. First time in 1999 in the World Under 10 Championship. Uh, it was Valentina Gobulen Golubenko or Gobulenko, I don't remember. And I lost in 2009 in Gibraltar to Nana Zagnitze. Yeah, I mean, if an event happens twice in your life you're less likely to forget it f5 so okay this is kind of getting solid for black but um, i'll get my bishop in play my bishop to h5 yeah 2019 yeah that's my big theory i'm gonna lose in 2019 to to young Well, oh, Tagban has so much info on my uh, loss to Valentina Gurubenko. But anyway, I, mean, I wouldn't be surprised to, to lose the games to, to women. I'm just trying not to lose at all, so... Uh, do I watch any sports? A lot of them. Like, literally too many I watch. Tennis, soccer, mm, NBA, sometimes even rugby. That's how low I... I'm getting cycling, snooker, um, sky jumping, um, and I'm pretty sure I, I forgot some. Why do so many top chess players watch NBA? It's fun. It's really fun to watch, and also we always sleep late, so, uh, so at least for European 
grandmasters, it makes sense. Chess? Do I watch chess? Eh, who knows? Australian rules football? Yeah, I wish I could say I watched that. I can't. Who's my favorite NBA player? Um, I mean, the, my favorite? It's hard to say. I, I don't really have a favorite. I, uh, I have people I hate, but uh, I feed on hate, not on love. Boxing? No, I, I don't watch boxing. I, I actually don't find that interesting at all for some reason. That's so French, yes, just by I am French. What did you expect? Laura Fresinek claims I'm also a great tennis player. Yeah, I doubt he meant that in a literal way. Did I watch the Super Bowl? Yeah, it was so boring. And I was kind of hating on, uh, on the Patriots, so that was very sad. Do I watch darts? Yeah, I watch darts. Yeah, of course I forgot darts. Frank and killed Lena? Yeah, I was expecting more from him. Yeah, so, yeah, just can't take on G6 because of 27 mate. Um, but yeah, he's still some sort of talent. And uh, yeah, but of course, the one we're all excited for right now is uh, Doncic, of course. Like, Actually, I'm quite excited uh, to see how he fares in the next few seasons and the, the end of this one as well. Do I watch golf? Nah. What cuisine do I like? Um, a lot of them. Okay, let's just take on C8 and take on B7 and take on H7 or maybe, maybe no. No, it would have been somewhere else. And with G8 mate, no. Okay, okay, and let's get perpetual stalemate. Time to harass another mod. Do I hate Westbrook? No, I actually, I actually like him for some reason. I know everyone hates him, but I actually like him. Like, um, um, yeah, yeah. Not for some reason. I always have had Westbrook's back and it made me win so many bets, so probably that's the reason I, I like him. So yeah, uh, so what kind of cuisine? Yeah, like really a lot of them. Uh, can I go night G5? Yeah, I can. Favorite football player? Yeah, Messi. Kevin Messi. Do I favor a particular NBA team? Um, not really. Again, I hate on teams. I don't support them. Musa Sissoko. Yeah, I don't really care what Musa Sissoko is. He's, a, he's an okay guy. He's working his ass off, but uh, he's not really like a huge talent. Curry or Durant? Uh, I prefer Curry, but uh, of course Durant is probably the stronger player. So yes, TB, did you win? At least she probably didn't like hate on you for losing. I hope that, at least. Okay, okay, so how do I go here? Maybe queen d6 and move b4. Just some harassment. Look at Donchinch or Trey Young, are you serious? I mean, Trey Young is good, but... Of course, people are more excited about Doncic, I think. Who is going to win the Grand Chester this year? Well, 
you have him right in front of you queen a2 would be seven I did answer the Messi Ronaldo question. Messi, I mean, I didn't think this would even, should even be a debate. Uh, let's take on f7, no, he's written with g7 and mating 3. Uh, poor thing is, oh yeah, 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 that's, that's a really exciting move, like, truly exciting in the sense uh, we can't really figure out how it's gonna end because he's been injured for so long but um, really for I, I really hope this is gonna be gonna work out okay queen h8 knight f7 so we up should should be it and now it's time to go to Indonesia with Gokul good luck All right, what am I doing to qualify for the next candidates? I'm streaming every other day of the week. Neymar and Mbappe. Okay, I really hate Neymar, so probably I'll pick Mbappe. I don't hate Mbappe yet. Is <clears throat> I don't like every facet of him, but uh, he's young. He's a good player, and maybe Neymar hasn't corrupted him too much yet. Curry or Arden? Uh, Curry, Curry every day. I mean, maybe Arden is the best player, is a better player, but um, yeah. Not a big fan. Oh yeah, no, Taylor. Uh, Taylor, let's say Taylor. But I haven't heard much of Ariana, to be fair. Uh, can you Jay-Z? Probably Jay-Z. And Kobe or LeBron? Uh, I mean, i not a fan of LeBron. But I have a very good friend of mine who will be very happy to hear that I still prefer LeBron over Kobe. Which as players do you hate? I hate you. And only you. How can I hate Neymar? Uh, because he spends half his time rolling on the floor and complaining about it. I mean, I'm not denying he's a great player. This uh, this is another debate. Did I have any offer to play for the USA? No. Is Vicinius going to be a good player? Probably. Probably. I'm also very happy for Benzema right now. Like he's. Uh, he is doing much better these days and proving a lot of people that yeah he is a decent um, decent guy like uh, can fulfill number nine in Real Madrid. Is the Sicilian Dragon viable? I think so. But I haven't played it in a long time anyway. What's my favorite night of variation, all of them? Who's going to win the Champions League? If I knew, I would bet like 10,000 on the winners and uh, or maybe 100,000. And then I'll play, I'll still play chess, but. Uh, Still, whom do I support in EPL? Uh, or EPL English Premier League, I assume. So yeah, uh, the Spurs. Is this how I like to spend my Saturday nights? I think it's fine, and uh, I've done every other thing available on a Saturday night anyway. Plus 
plus the knight will still be young okay so i'm putting some pressure with pawn on d4 um so yeah at some point i will certain to play knight takes d4 but not yet when did i start supporting them you mean the spurs well not really sure uh, oh no i think uh, that's right when lewis arrived to the spurs because well uh, the Leon connection why not open a twitch uh, channel i have a twitch channel twitch.tv slash mvl chess i thought right this is um oh, okay now let's play bishop f4 i'm not even sure i want to take the exchange because now the rook is trapped but after d5 95 i might not want to to get the exchange anyway but uh what i could do is play queen g5 queen g3 next i was last seen playing chess that must be a mistake okay so i cannot play queen g5 because of knight e6 mm. What exactly should I do? In a 33 rook c2, it's not clear what I'm... Okay, let's play queen h4. This, this was my first impression. Also, after knight e6, I'm still not sure what I can do. Like, I don't see mate. I'll have to figure this out. Um, because bishop is freaking h1 is not ideal. Uh, maybe knight f3 check. Let's go for this. Will I stream more often? Um, yeah, there's been a white in my streaming this week, and hopefully uh, it will keep on at least until I start playing uh, back in tournaments. Spurs and City only top clubs in EPL not to have a history. I mean, it depends what you call a history, like. Um, They've won championships, and uh, the Spurs do have quite a uh, solid history, but of course, it's not like Man U, who have won so many titles. Uh, am I kind of in trouble here? Probably, but uh, yeah, let's play Queen G3 now, and actually after Bishop D8, Queen H2 is made, so I'm getting a bit like... I hope that's not his clan, no, that's Borvik, French. Yeah, Queen h2, King of 1, Queen h1, King of 2, Queen g2, and Queen g1 will be made. Borvik, I don't really like Evian. So, Yogesh, next up. Good luck. So e4, let's try to get another knight off. Uh, how long will Magnus keep his title? 2020, because then he will play against me. Thanks, go cool. Yeah, it was a fun game. Okay, so knight off, we got the knight off. Let's play e5. Do I watch your vision? I can't watch everything. So I don't watch your vision. Peugeot or BMW? I actually don't have um, a driving license. Do I play soccer? Well, to say I play it might be offensive to people who actually play it. But yeah yeah uh but i enjoy it anyway even if i'm really bad at it 
Am I a Power Ranger? I mean, if I were, I would be in hiding. Knight d5? I think it's a pawn. I like pawns. How come Hansen bet you in the bullet? I know. I'm offended myself. By myself. By my skills. Chess by has seen me when everyone losing control of the ball to Magnus? Whoa. You've seen so obvious things. Did I just run knight a5? I did. But I'll survive that anyway. Rook d1. Mm, let's play queen c7. My certain knight e4. Do I think it's fun? Yeah, I know, but uh, in Paris, it's I don't feel like it is, so I I don't see the need. Mm. Okay, knight a5. This is a good move. I think I'll just play with g8 a lot for uh, I'm not really calm, I'm nervous but I'm moving like my legs so you cannot see it and you cannot really hear it and uh, well it's not really nerves actually it's just because I'm used to do it and I I will really do it. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's why I play GTX F6. I open the G file. Uh, Lob or Ogier, probably Lob, but uh, yeah, actually, like uh, all the racing and boxing, these are the two weird sports uh, categories I don't really watch too often. Uh, okay, we'll take C4. I'm not even sure I'm better anymore. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm pretty sure I'm not better anymore. But I like to deal with that in my own way. By releasing the full power of my imagination. Chess best refuses to believe that the score will stand. Hmm, interesting. I mean, Eric is a really good bullet player too, but uh, yeah, I'm expecting as well to to fare better next time I play him. Can I recommend the book on opening and the one on strategy? Well, okay, I haven't read books in a long long time and I can afford this because I did in the past how am I going to stop the pawns? you mean the B and A pawns? I'm not going to stop them, I'm going to roll my own pawns B5, well actually no, Bishop D6 might stop them And then I'll just roll my own pawns. So i5, bishop i5, b6 would be the best way to proceed, but uh, I'm in time. So after b7, bishop c7. So you can promote, but then I'll promote my d pawn as well. So book d1, uh, let's play h5 and h4. Okay, now I take on g3. And this should be over. This should be 5. Do I have a mate? Not quite yet. But let's do this. e3, now I certainly e2. Okay, e2, e1, and mate. 
Okay. So now Kisanski is up. Good luck. Oh, I didn't even see the game I started. Um, okay, let's play the Gwenfeld. Mm, all right. Ninety-four. Okay, this is a um, very topical line. Uh, I think I should play c5. Bishop d7. Since I don't read books, my prep is either stuff I know or engine stuff. Yeah, mostly. No, of course, I mean, I will read. Uh, I mean, anyway, books preparation is mostly engine preparation these days. Will I do this again? Uh, possibly, yeah. And uh, do I play b5 or c4? No, c4 is uh, is not good. It will run like d2 and bishop f3, so I'll go b5. So work c1. Okay, you might want C4 next. This is actually not going so well. Probably I have to go C4 now. If I D2, E5 at least. Yeah, E5 and Bishop F3. I'll think whether I want E4 or Queen D7. Probably I'll just want E4. Magnus Carlsen won the title to win a, I mean, he tends to, to win a lot of tournaments he plays in. So yeah, Bishop F8. I have a solid pull on the position because of the space advantage. So this is good. G4? Whoa. I didn't expect that. Mm. But maybe F3 is next. So this actually makes quite some sense. Um, yeah. I missed that. I can't believe how many times I'm saying I missed that today. This is actually not great for me. Because um, if I take bishop f3, queen e6, d5 win the piece. So I probably should go something along the line of f5. And hoping that his queen on b2 is out of play enough not to create uh, something too bad against my king. Oh, okay, that's a blunder. That's a sad blunder. 94. Maybe it was not a blunder. No, it was a blunder. Yeah, queen g6 check. I mean, even rook 4 is definitely playable. Probably winning as well, but queen g6. Just ends the fun. And I'm a burst killer. Okay, let's take on h3. What's my record against Naka in bullet? Uh, I would say 30% more or less. 
especially like at least on nice you see back back in the days it was that mm, i'm not really sure but yes 30 percent or something like this sounds about about right reading the chat makes people miss things more yeah that's actually true but i have to keep up with the ch with the chat anyway Okay, Duke of Eight, now King of Eight, and I think this is over because the Knight on G3 is pinned. Okay, this is cheeky, but I'm not even gonna allow it. King of Eight, Queen of Two, but no, not today. Okay, let's take this, take on C3 and hopefully the game will be over soon, Knight G4 is a threat and it is mate. Okay, so now it's another mod, better known by uh, short and T because otherwise it would be really be too hard to pronounce. So. I'm playing T. Go T? Yeah. I mean, does my beard count as a go T? I don't think so. Okay. Um. Yeah, I haven't really thought about it, but yeah, let's go C5, long castle, probably short castle was uh, at least safer. Now basically I'm gonna get some C6. I'm hearing a lot of stuff about Chesboa. Oh, they launched the weight. Yeah, good stuff, guys. Am I a vieux monsieur on the chess? Now that's Jules Moussard. Yeah, let's get some more water. My English is really good for French. I didn't think the French had such a bad English. Like, I think uh, Spanish and Italians have way worse English in general, but... Uh, uh, also, maybe I'm biased because I lived in Paris or near Paris all my life and people out uh, in pro more provincial cities don't really speak English, that's actually true. So now I'm, okay, I was not even going to play Knight X6, but Rook C3 and Mate. So yeah, really long castle, not a good idea. All right, it is, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I can't read the name. But good luck to you. Long castle, oh, you haven't lived or died. Well, you kind of died on this game, in this game, so. Uh, okay, that's poison pawn. Let's not go for poison pawn because it's a draw.
LED blue, yes. Okay, this is uh, this is really an old line. I don't have many memories of that. Mm, okay, nine eight four. I think the move was e five. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to 97. Hello, do I stream on Twitch? Yeah, I do. Uh, Twitch.tv slash chess. For how long have I been playing chess? Um, for the best part of my life, like 23 years. Who even needs all this theory? Sadly, I do. Uh, but yeah, that makes me very sad. I wish I could live off um, love and fresh water. I'm not sure that's a thing in English, but it's definitely a thing in French. So bishop f6, yeah, I'll take. Position looks ugly for white. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Um, Queen h5 is a good move. Cheeky little move. If knight a4, knight takes e6. Should work actually. So I think I just long castle. Oh, knight f3, I think knight e2 was better because this signs a pawn. Also, game is definitely not over. Yeah, free pawn, this is, this is just the best. So, rook f1. Um, Let's play bishop d6. And let's play queen e7. Although I'm not over d5. But I can take on e5. And the queen e7, bishop e7, this is not so bad. Um, let's play with d7 anyway. Kind of double on to d5. White as weak dark squares. That's actually true. The squares of dark color will be an issue as soon as I bring a bishop to c3, for instance. Can I h4? So yeah, that gets my bishop where I want it to be. Do I have a favorite liquor? Uh, I'm not a fan of liquors. Uh, I like uh, strong alcoholic drinks uh, like rum, vodka. Mm, but liquors, yeah, not. Not really that kind of person. Absent now, it's too far too strong for me. Piano? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I actually like um, uh, uh, Piano uh, and around these lines, yeah. This is actually 
quite quite a nice drink. I'm proud to say I've never had coffee in my life so far or tea. Mm, I've had tea. I've even had coffee, but I didn't like it. Okay, let's play queen d7. I threatened bishop e4. Now because of the mate and you won. What about Kiowayam? Well, I mean, that's not the liquor, but yeah, that's that's quite all right. Uh, who says I haven't been disowned just by? Okay, Kundi one is mate. Okay, and it's time for another game. Maybe a Norwegian will be my downfall, like he has been for the last ten years or so. But the good news is it might not be this Norwegian I'm thinking about. Okay, so this is a very normal line so far. Someone says I'm much cooler than Magnus. Magnus is actually quite cool. But he gets so many requests. I guess he drones a bit in it sometimes. Self-depreciating game is next level. Uh, I don't like to self-depreciate. Uh, also, I like the, the irony of it, but I don't like to self-depreciate. I don't have any reason to do so. Uh, okay. One. I'm not even sure I'm better here, but uh, oh no, I am better. But it's not huge. Do I have a lead chess account? Uh, yeah, but I don't use it that often. What made me realize I was better, you mean in that game? Um, well, I'm not sure I'm really better, but uh, I have to pretend I am. Why do I hate the nice mods? Because some everyone hates them. They prevent us. Oh, what did I do? I just allowed bishop a4, bishop b3. That's not really. Well, thankfully, he missed it. Still not far from over, anyway. But I'll go bishop c7 and rook a1. And that should help me get some something nice going because now i'll just play b5 he'll take i'll go with a7 next and just push b6 b7 and there will no, be no grinding time because this is just winning now There is nothing you can do, sadly. The rook on d7 is too passive. 
How did I respond to Anish Diu when he said on top of all his problems he is French? Well, it is a problem. Alright. Uh, Alright, I'm waiting for some more people to challenge me. Waiting for challenges now. What do I think of the French defense? Pretty good opening. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna play, I think it's only in one minute to ch for a change. But no, I'm, I can't read the chat anymore. If I could buy Alpha Zero, well, I can't, so... Uh, really, I don't like to work on hypotheticals. You didn't know I spoke English in my streams. Yeah, I mean, sometimes I do French streams as well, but uh, mostly I stream in English. And every time I stream in English, of course the French would say, Ah, you should stream in French. And when I stream in French, uh, you should stream in English, but uh, yeah, this is how it goes. And let's not forget this is bullet, no? And, but anyways, this looks pretty bad. Some of G5 will happen or something even worse. Queen F6, let's go Knight F5, then Rook F1. Yeah, and then um, it's pretty much over. Knight h6, rook takes g5, rook takes g6, rook f7, this returns rook h7 mate. He parries that, now I go knight e2, knight f4 is next, and g3 is mate. Let's go. Can I crush Danny Wrench again? Uh, like, yeah. That happens so often. Okay, okay, so let's play. Um, let's play J pop. It's three minutes. Yeah, tough like Kisansky. I'm a tough guy. Oh, we need for check. That was not a great idea. This happens all the time on the puzzle rush, so you actually puzzle rush is a good way to to avoid this kind of mishaps. D4, let's go D5. 
Lasciamo per fare. Yeah, I can't always place a coin first, so I'll just I'll just place that instead. I hope you guys are having fun. And let's go H4. Again, shy children, it could work. And I'm not even sure, but I am no child of yours. But 95 is a cheeky move. Um, Okay, let's take on e5. I think that works more or less fine. So g4 I want probably bishop h4. He goes h5, which I didn't expect. Mm, should I go h6? Should I go h6? I don't really want to. Mm. No, let's go d4. More women in the chess world, would that be cool? Yeah, of course. There's not enough women playing, that's for sure. Well, it will not play h6, no, they won't, because then this is actually good news for me. Have I used Lila? No. But I'm following improvements of Lila. So f3. It's a good move. Um, let's go d3 anyway. But, oh no, d3 is stupid. Man takes, takes on d8, I'm actually slightly worse. Um, yeah, kind of messed up this one. Yeah, Lila is a chess engine similar to Alpha Zero. That's the algorithm is um, based on uh, uh, um, neural intelligence. If I get a chance, can I play the Danish Gambit? Uh, no, because I have self-respect. What celebrity would I rate as a perfect 10? Oh, this is interesting. Um, uh, perfect 10, this is... This is tough. Because uh, there's always something that can be improved. Okay, I kind of got away with what I did. Do I listen to metal? No, not really. Uh, I mean, it did up um, like a couple of songs or whatever, but uh, not on a regular basis. Okay, that's another pawn for the up for grabs. And another one. And another one. This is party time. Uh, coming back on the perfect end question. Uh, I mean, I'm sure I'm think of something, but of someone, but um yeah oh 
Or maybe it just means there's no such thing as a perfect 10. But, oh yeah, yeah. I thought of some. Blake Lively is quite close to, to a perfect 10. Let's go for Blake Lively. Alright, next game will be Okia from Switzerland, I think. All right, let's go Budapest. What's the best setup against Ipo defense? Oh, Ipo is scary. Like, imagine yourself facing a Ipo. Uh, angry Ipo. Uh, uh, angry. Uh, hungry, hungry, and angry hippo. Like, I don't think he would fare well. Um, okay. Let's go for it. Mm, this I like. I like three points. I also like three pieces. Do I know if Alpha Zero was available for uh, people? I don't think it was. Yeah, so just uh, because people are making fun of me for the age sound, yeah, I know, this is why I'm not perfectly fluent in English, the age sound, I hate the age sound. And let's play Queen H for check, Rook G8, and no Queen H, well, if Queen G2, maybe not Queen H3, that would be sad. Oh, okay, resign. Uh, okay, so it's time for Yo Gesh. Let's go, three minutes. Why would Ipo be an unfortunate name for a chess opening? And what's my IMC? Uh, it evolves. Um, when I get fatter and then thinner, or maybe you're talking about something else, but then I don't know which one, what it would be. But anyway, along the lines of 21, 22. All right. Was it sometime funny in Gibraltar? Um, yeah, yeah, I enjoy Gibraltar quite a lot. I was mostly out with the French guys. My accent is charming. Yes, yeah, I say that of every French people. For some reason, we have a really bad accent, but people like it, so so we don't need to change it. That's Alright, let's play bishop d1 and queen b5. Uh, okay. Okay, queen d7, let's go f5. And now queen d7, f takes g6, this wins. And, well, rook f7 is also good, so. But let's just play bishop f7, sometimes simple is, simple is best. That's my favorite place to go on holiday in France. Uh, probably, um, probably the Alps. But I'm 
honestly not going on holidays that often. All right, let's get all these pawns. I am the angry po with all these pawns and okay, it's pure look time. What's my MVL Twitch? Well, uh, that's called MVL Chess. Do I watch Game of Thrones? I resigned after the first 10 minutes of the first episode. Someone wants to line up my beard. I do have someone taking care of that, but uh, yeah, I'm not doing going there as enough enough often uh, as I should, but that's really because I'm lazy and uh, I never enjoy going for the barber and stuff like this. I resign on GOT, I know. It's just too many characters, too complicated for me. Do I play Arston? No, I played Magic at the time. Uh, I never started Arston and I'm thankful, I mean, my time, my free time is thankful, I never did, probably. Magic, yeah, yeah, that was the thing I had, uh, many middle school and high school friends playing that, so, um, so yeah, that really was quite fun. Okay, bishop h7 is, I think, a tad optimistic, but it has some points, yeah, king g8, queen h5, but then I think queen f4 should. Uh, to be honest, I really didn't consider it, like, I didn't think it was legal even, but uh, it had some venom. Uh, do I play Stackworth too? No. Uh, I know a lot of chess players who did. Um, I played a little bit of Warcraft, but I'm way too slow. Uh, so yeah, maybe Bullet is actually a good preparation for, for Stackworth and Warcraft, but yeah, you know, I'm really not good enough at this. Who's my friends in the top, along with Stefan? I mean, I think I'm doing okay with more or less everyone. Um, and, uh, but yeah, my closest connections are with the French guys, of course. Um, yeah, actually I did used to play Warcraft on a trackpad. Um, that was so sad. Do I have a photographic memory? I guess sort of, yeah. Uh, but uh, not a real photographic memory, but that's still my best ability. And I definitely don't have an eidetic memory. All right, so yeah, Bishop H7 really didn't turn out so great. Um, so yeah, no, I'm the one getting the attack going. All right, um, now let's just play knight f6. Also, I'm 
I am wrong in Queen B5, but then probably Rook B8 is just on Knight D8. I'm just gonna end up being fine. Then better Mbappe is neither. But I mean, Mbappe is obviously better. Am I a Lyon fan? Yes. So let's play Queen G4 now. And probably I could also, yeah. I might have been better off playing King F8 first. But anyway. King G7, if Rook is super, probably B6 now. It's a good move. King G2, this is interesting. Mm, I can't really go knight h let's go b6. Do I have a favorite La Liga side? No, not really. Coffee is too afraid to play me. Yeah, because as he knows, I don't like coffee. Messi is going to destroy Lyon in the UCL. Yeah, that's very likely. Sadly. I ate it when Alex Morgan played for Olympique Lyonnais. Yeah, I'm not really watching uh, women's soccer. Does a pro earn m good money? Um, depends. Depends on your skills. Alright, so... Okay, this one's kind of over. King f3, I should just take on d4 and play knight c2. And this is over. And now it's item Aga, another Norwegian. Alright, alright. Uh, okay, some London system. Let's get some H4 going. And that's be good. Also, I have been training at Puzzle Rush secretly in the last few days. I've done a couple of 53, a couple of 52, so I, I hope. I sec still secretly hope to beat Naka's score, even if I think I cannot. Oh, wait, it's my turn. I did it again. You guys should warn me when I don't realize this is my turn. Oh, wait, also after GH5 I was going to remove, I mean after Knight h5, oh yeah, but after g h5, rook h5, pre move wasn't great because of bishop g4. With time I will beat Nakan Pazarwash, I'm not sure. It's really, really tough out there. Yeah, if I beat his score, I think he would be really mad. Uh, I actually heard um, someone tell me that uh, someone made a joke on him on one of his tweets that I had beaten his score and he was like, no, no, no way. I drink much less water than Naka and I also talk much less. 
Well, I feel like I've been talking quite a lot, to be honest, but uh, who knows? Are MGL streams pretty informative? What are MGL streams? Unless you meant MVL streams. Yeah, I need to be more hyped when I play online, but somehow I'm just too calm. Uh, okay, this is going well. Now I have full compens. I mean, not only do I have full compensation, but also, of course, I have a huge attack on the king, knight e4, some knight f6. Are there any practical jokers on two? Uh, not sure what you mean actually. From the football world, who is like Naka? Um, I'm not sure. Like, there's no one like Naka. Alright, I want a queen. And let's mate now. Is Calvados with is that good? Um, I haven't had in a long, long time, so really I wouldn't be able to say. Oh, uh, funny tricks on people. Okay, that would be Lev Aronian. Okay, so let's play rook c6. Yeah, and now queen d7 is next. And queen b7 if he's played queen c8. Uh, king c8. Okay, so let's play a couple more. Uh, do I have one minute? No, I only have three minutes. Okay, let's play a couple more three minutes and then I'll go for closer rush. And then I think that would be good. Okay, okay, so let's go. Let's castle. If castle king side, I will play e5. Uh, can I play e5? Uh, yeah, I can. It is sort of a puzzle rush. Well, not anymore. Uh, Bishop g5 is a sad end to my puzzle rush attempt. Do I speak French? It is a bit rusty. Like whenever I go out to a country and then come back after come back after two weeks, and I'm like uh, heading to a taxi or whatever, and I'm like speaking English sometimes. And then realizing, oh wait, that's not my language. Puzzle rush hype, of course. See, I so hype for puzzle rush is real. It's literally the worst thing that has happened to chess professionals, probably. Uh, Knight d4, yeah, okay, let's play e4. Let's go like this was a misclick. And anyway, I wanted to do this against knight h4. And uh, should I do rook f5? Yeah, rook f5, queen e4. This is good. PR is bad. Uh, not sure why it would be bad. Uh, rook f ah, puzzle rush. Yeah, yeah, puzzle rush. Puzzle rush is bad for your, uh, for your chess. But it's it's a good thing to enjoy. Uh, before take, oh yeah, 
Oh yeah, that's the puzzle rush we were looking for. Okay, one more and then puzzle rush. All right, do I have one minute? I don't, so go cool. Let's go. And this is my last game before puzzle rush. It's bad because it's addictive and addictive stuff is bad by essence. Thanks everyone again for tuning in and uh, well, fun's not over because after this one last game, I'll go for some puzzle wash. Sweet puzzle wash, yeah. I have time for three or maybe even more puzzle rush. Um, chess is addictive. It is, but uh, playing chess cannot hurt your chess. Playing puzzle rush can hurt your chess. Okay, let's go for G4H4 again. Addicted to upper crumble? That doesn't seem so. Uh, like unlikely. And let's get the H file open. No, that's okay. We wasn't expected this to happen. Yeah, did take c4, I didn't really expect that. Let's take on h6, open the g file then. Everyone wants to see a 56. What would have been Bobby's Fisher puzzle wash score? I have no fucking idea. 56 or you are subbing? What if I do 57? Can I pronounce my surname correctly in French? Vachier Lagrave. Language? No, no. There's no such such thing as language. Language. You should watch your language because you have mods, but I don't have a mod, so I can say whatever I want. Right. If they tell me to stop, I will stop. All right. And Goku has 15 more seconds before I go to Puzzle Rush. Because I will play instantly, of course. Because that's who I am. Other streamers talk a lot worse. I know, I know. Uh, and I'm not worried about who I am. Okay. All right. Let's go to Puzzle Rush. And hopefully. Is the setup okay? Wait, I'll need a bit of time to set things up. Um, 
but yeah, let's try it like this. Yeah, should be okay. Let's go. Okay, the first ones are really not that difficult. Also, I've done bad things in the past, like missing these sort of things. Uh, C4, yeah. Queen B7, okay, so far. So far, so good. Bishop D6, I'm assuming. D4, okay. That's really okay. Queen H6, Bishop D5, okay. Bishop F7, uh, wait, Knight G6, probably, yeah. Queen D8, Rook C8. Queen A6, Queen A2. Uh, do I go Queen H4? I guess so. D5, Knight C, yeah. Rook E8, F6, okay. Knight G3. Uh, this is easy. Bishop B5, let's get a queen. Oh, Knight B1 is mate. Queen H8. Oh, okay, that's one mistake. I probably try to be too fancy or something. Uh, queen b6, rook a3, rook a7, queen b7. Uh, sad mistake. Knight h4. Um, knight f2 and queen h4. Uh, I always get confused. But this is mate, yeah. Um, queen e7, alright. Knight c5, so this is double attack. Queen. F3, I assume, yeah. ET. Do I have to go with D5? Yes. Yes, I do. B2. Okay, King B6. Uh, okay, 3, Queen C3. This is going to be made. Um, Queen H1, Bishop H3, Queen F3, Knight C2. Mm. Okay, Queen D4. Yeah, that's right. Um, okay, for the first time I need to think, this should be it, okay, and then bishop h6 or bishop f4, probably bishop f4, yeah, maybe two, um, this one is tough. Oh wait, my queen is under attack too. Uh, probably knight f5 then, and rook d7, yeah. Uh, should I go queen a4, bishop c6, maybe bishop d7, lots of things. Oh, probably queen a4, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, this one I know. It's always easier when you know it. Um, dc, bishop e3, mm, and cb, yeah, yeah. Uh, rook e7, knight f6, queen g4, check. Uh, this, is, this should be a draw somehow. Uh, bishop h6, maybe? Yeah. Uh, okay. And now e7 and g8, knight. Well, this is cute. Rook c6, do I need to go king h2 or something? Or, g or can I take, take, play g4? Yeah, yeah, this is what I should have done. Okay, so like rook h7 probably. Do I go bishop g6? I think so. Then I go rook f6 and rook d7. Yeah. Um, no, rook g8. Okay, so I have to go g7. Okay, this is cute. Okay, okay. I got it. Um, okay, so I probably have to go h6, no, that was not h6, too bad. Uh, bishop d4 and queen c3, yeah, let's get to 51. Uh, queen h6, yeah, it has to be this, rook d5, and I'm assuming queen g5, and knight f6, maybe. Yeah, okay. 
that minifier work, yes, and g4. And then 96, the other thing. Oh. Wait, if that was 96, I have to check just to know if I was on 53. Yeah, I was on 53. So annoying. But anyway, that's no 56. Okay, let's do it again. And less talking. is going all right uh, a2 a1 okay four, nine, three, okay Queen six let's take with this one uh we see four probably this wins a piece uh knight f7 queen h6 mate uh, Where's the mate? There's no mate. Knight g5, I'm assuming. Knight f4, okay. Um, knight f3, g4. Ah, mistake. Oh, bishop g4. Uh, queen f3 no, queen g2, this is his mate. Um, Interesting. We have to play this, yeah. And the eighth knight, yes. Uh, okay, no, rook c3 first. Rook e1, yes. Queen h5, and knight f7, check, check, mate. Um, so here, do I start with queen e1 or queen g3? Do I? Probably this, yeah. Oh yeah. I ate when it lags. But at least it gave me an easy one to not a lag again, come on. Not a fucking lag again. Ah, queen h8. I can't end up the lag. Yeah. Tilted me. Give me a few seconds to recover from that. And I'll go for the third and last run. 
Let's go. Except if it starts lagging immediately, then I will stop right there. like this. of h7 uh, unclear this one is unclear uh, cannot be knight g bishop g5 can't we be knight h4 bishop h7 maybe yeah okay this was it uh would be two yeah yeah, take and take on before. Yeah, and now queen c2 must be made. Uh, bishop e3. No, wait, queen a8. Uh, not really good. Oh, wait, no, it's actually good. Um, knight h3. No, but this is made. Um, how do I finish this? Uh, I like this, yeah. Bishop C3 is made. Um, queen A, Queen D4 first, then Rook one and King F7. Okay. And now Rook G5, Rook Bishop F2 and H6. Well, um, should I take? Yeah, I should take. Okay, Queen C8 and Bishop A3 and Queen F8 mate. Um, okay, check f4. Yeah, f4. Go queen d6. Uh, can I do something like this and then something like this and then probably take on g7 and then rook e1 and rook d1. Yeah, bishop c4. Ah, not bishop c4. Never mind. What do I do? Do I take on f4? Yeah. Oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. I'm collapsing. Um. Yeah, I don't know what to do. So let's do quit and play again last one guys let's win this thing
okay, okay. This is going all right. Um, oh, hanging work. This is good. Check and check and how do I make like this here? Yeah. Uh, C3A before, okay. Check. Two one. You have seven, yeah. Bishop e6, I'm guessing. Queen g7. Queen g8 and bishop d6, alright. Uh, king e2, queen e4, bishop c5, bishop d4, okay. Queen c6, queen h1. Uh, should I go? Yeah, I should go like g5, of course. And uh, bishop c4, okay. I love when these are uh, easy puzzles. Uh, okay, with d5, with d4. I love when it's uh, easy puzzles. Uh, rook c3, maybe on cage eight. Doesn't matter. No, ah, it did matter. Okay, rook e7, checkmate. Um, where is my mate here? Oh, it's mating too. Okay, this is also made into 95. Okay, 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 bishop d5 and knight. It was not 97, damn. And uh, should I go knight? I should take first and then to do this. Okay. Um, I think this is it. Oh, yeah. Okay, mess up. Can't finish on 40. Got to play last one. Love the smaller mates because it's so automatic. You don't really need to think. Same with the fox, or with this sort of stuff. Uh, A5, yeah, that wins a piece. Uh, okay, check, check. Take the queen. Um, should probably take on d5 and take on f3 and take on h4. Uh, yes, I should do this. So far I got very lucky on the puzzles, I have to say. Uh, rook d6, okay, this is cute. Um, queen f5, probably queen f5 and bishop h4. Then, for lack of a better move, queen f4. Um, rook d2 is going to be made here. Yeah. Uh, rook e5 and d4, okay. This is going quite well. Uh, take, take, check, check. It, whoa. This was tricky. Like, who cares about finding queen d3? Uh, knight d3, yeah, yeah. Simple as that. Queen e3 doesn't work yet, so. Should I play d4? Yeah. I should play d4. 
Shock of Fate, do I have Knights? Maybe it's this. Yeah. C1, so. No, Queen C1 is. Queen A5, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Knight D5 and D4. Okay. Okay, this is Cast Power of Cup of. Uh, rook G1 check, not Rook F2. Better to do mate. Um, well, this one is tougher. I think maybe Queen A5. Yeah, and Knight D3. Alright. And Knight D3, Queen F4. I don't see anything better. And now Knight E5. Oh yeah, Knight E5, I missed that first, that's why. Um, okay, this one I know. So I should go bishop b8, I think. And something like rook e3 wins. Yeah. Um, okay, let's go check. Maybe king h7, simple as that, yeah? Yeah, simple as that. Uh, rook g4, okay. And rook g7, don't take the queen. So, okay, this is very lucky. Um, this one will be diffic more difficult. Um, B7? Whoa, would be 7 Okay, N I guess... Oh, this is... Oh, yeah, okay. This was tougher than I anticipated. Okay. One more move to find. Oh, yes. 53. Okay. Let's try to get to... Um, oh, so close to 54. Okay. Ending on this, oh, it was actually a good one. All right, all right. Thank you everyone for following. It's been night precisely, so I don't feel bad giving you the goodbye and uh, see you around on my channel. I'll be playing the puzzle watch more often. Apparently, you guys like it. Bye bye.